And by the end of this video, I am sure that you guys will now understand and also implement what I'm gonna share in this video. Sauce it up. Swerving in out of lanes, party all I every day. I'ma keep on going, I just want another honey K. Shotty wanna wear the rain, ride her down my everything. I'm here to terror, got me serving through the interstate. Yeah, run away from the past and the nonsense. Tired of toxic ends, not an option. Made it up from the mud, I'ma find this. Taking off hella fast, I'm a Martian. Yeah, pressure on my body, I don't sink. Yeah, never had a copy for the clicks, no, nah, no. Nah. Money always got me feeling big, yeah In the drop top, zooming 96, I'm gone That's the most adding up Got money making hits, now you're not catching up Pull me up, yeah, I'm a drink, now there ain't any luck I've been working, it's a bitch You can catch me, post it up with a yeah, let it rip 5K on a chain, that's where I be gone Look both ways for the ops, yeah, they want me gone Trust no games, I don't play, I don't want it, nah I was down bad, now I'm out like a star People in the past tense, doing bad like a dart Everybody watch me, cause I'm on it and they not Put it in a high speed, kick it, yeah, the foreign high Can't nobody cross me, I be rolling with my stars I swore in and out of lanes, party all I every day I'ma keep on going, I just want another hundred K Shawty wanna wet it rain, ride her down my everything I'm here to tire, got me starving through the interstate all right guys, so we just got a little workout in now. This is the morning of Tuesday now We have a dual meet on Thursday at Mankato, Minnesota And now I just thought you know I'd take today to you know film and kind of show you guys how to really prepare yourself for a wrestling match Because you know I get this question all the time and a lot of of course a lot of people that watch my stuff are You know more newer wrestlers and by the end of this video I am sure that you guys will now understand and also implement what I'm gonna share in this video But first let me show you this crazy thing actually so a Parkside alumni guy actually works for a company that like I think makes these or distributes them um, but what it's supposed to do is like increase like your oxygen like in your muscles by like 17% by just laying on it I guess it just uses like frequencies and stuff so I honestly really don't understand what it works but I did it this morning he said you're supposed to do it you know before you work out and then kind of after you work out um, so we're gonna try this again after we work out I think it actually kind of worked uh, before the workout Also, just a quick shout out. I'm watching uh, the Joey Bianchi new vlog um, as I was on this doing this math thing. But Joey is an up and coming YouTuber, of course, in the wrestling scene. He's doing a really good job. So if you guys want to go check out his videos, I'll actually link that in the description. Hey, Ross, sauce it up. Oh my gosh. You guys see this? Chef Caden. So this is actually leftovers because I made pasta the other day. Um, we got this Parmesan garlic marinara sauce. Bro, like that. <laughs> I'm just saying, man, this is good. But in order to get prepared yourself for a wrestling match, it's not all about the, you know, the physical performance, what you do in practice. It's what you're filling yourself with, whether it be food, whether it be liquids, supplements, protein. You know, you have to be really smart about it. And, you know, there's a lot of good ways you can do it. There's a lot of bad ways you can do it. For instance, eating, you know, a lot of snack food, a lot of crap food, like stuff high in sodium, really high, you know, in bad fats, sugar. So one thing that I've been doing is, of course, been having this pasta and then also just, you know, some protein powder and, of course, drinking a lot of water. Shout out to Transparent Labs. And you might be asking yourself, Caden, where, where are you? What is this green thing behind you? Well, thank you so much for asking. This is the new and improved setup of the room we got the ring light here of course you know we got the dual monitor i decided to have a green screen because you know your boy is actually gonna start streaming now you guys can follow me on twitch that will be linked in the description my twitch is just my name caden henschel and then also i can be very very close to my vision board now so it's nice just to literally look over on the same head level or eye level and then also i got my calendar down there which i can track you know what i'm gonna be doing all right, now we're back at it for some dinner, and today we are having 
the good old Bush's baked beans. And now I actually just came from practice as well, and it was a hard practice, might I say. Um, I got wrecked, but you know what? You win some, you lose some. And you know, of course, with you know cutting weight or really watching weight, trying to get down, of course, to your weight class, um, staying hydrated is so so important. You know, it's happened to me in a couple matches, of course, in my career, um, and I see it all the time. Is people being dehydrated? They're cutting out water either way too early or they're really not recovering. Now after practice, I'm gonna try out the new liquid IV flavor I've yet to try out. So this one's a Kai Berry. Let's go try this baby out. So from the box, it says that one of these sticks is really equal to drinking three water bottles. Let's see if it's fact or cap. Okay, so for this flavor, I'm not tasting too much flavor. It's not like a flavor overload, but definitely I'm gonna have to still stick with watermelon. That's my all time favorite flavor. Now I really do recommend Liquid IV if you guys want 25% off, use my code Caden Henschel or click the link in the description. But then of course we talked about how it's not, you know, all physical. It's kind of this preparation of your nutrition and everything. But being physically prepared, of course, is so important. You know, you guys pretty much just know if you had a bad week of training, maybe you didn't want to show up, maybe you missed a day, and you you had a match coming up and you're like, you're having less confidence in yourself. You know, you're out there on the mat, you're just getting winded so much more easier. Guys, making sure that you're in the practice room and showing up every single day. You know, the laws of success do not care really how you feel, that you know, they care if you show up or not. Of course, working hard is gonna get you there, but also by pushing yourself past your limits, you know, kind of testing yourself how far you can really go, whether this be on the cardio machine, in a live match, or whatever it may be. Now, another thing you guys can do, which I know probably 99.9% .9 of you guys are not doing. You can take a piece of paper and pen and you can literally write your path to victory. I don't even know if you can read that. You guys can literally write something like this um, where I have neutral, top, and bottom, and I list my top three moves for each of them. Now, of course, you can also do your hand fighting techniques. You can do all these things, but putting the pen to paper and kind of just seeing them through your eyes, like, okay, these are, you know, the tools nest like in your toolbox, like in order for you to complete your task. And by looking at them from a different way, a different perspective, it's almost like, you know, a quiz or a test you're studying for. Like sometimes in a match, you go out there and you don't know what to do. You guys ever have that where that happens to you? I know it's happened to me before, but by kind of studying wrestling, using it, being a student of the sport, you can have your muscle memory and also, of course, you know, your mental memory to remember, you know, what to do. Like, what are you best at? What are you good at? What are you not good at? So by doing these things, you know, I can guarantee it's going to help you guys out a lot. And I highly suggest this. And last but not least, how to prepare for a wrestling match. I'm going to leave you guys with this. Do not sweat it. So many people get so amped up in their thoughts. And I've seen this time and time again, you know, of course, of guys who should win. And even me in matches, I should have won. Sometimes you're thinking this match is going to be easy. I'm higher ranked. I know I'm better, whatever. But guess what? The worst ranked guy goes out and absolutely destroys you. So... How, do, how does this have to do with anything? This means that success without preparation is preparation to fail. Just know that anyone can beat anyone and only you have the opportunity to decide who you beat. You know, just remember, no, no one's gonna bow down to you. No one's gonna give you the easy win. I mean, this is a fight. This is a combat sport. So being prepared for a wrestling match, you know, it's crucial. But you know, every match, every meet, every tournament, you have the opportunity to prepare better so that you can have a better chance of winning. I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. I know I shared some absolute gems that I know it could benefit so many of you guys out there. I would really, really appreciate if you guys would like the video and also subscribe. And with that being said, guys, we will see you guys at Mankato, Minnesota. The video for that will be out Friday, hopefully at 6 p.m. So be there. This is Caden's vlog. Merch link is in the description. Thanks, guys.